Anyway, that's it. Now let's make fun of Ralph a little bit. Uh, Gabe Hoffman says, Ethan Ralph is currently delinquent on two months of child support for his only son, $800 per month for a total of $1,600 for January and February, due on the 1st, which I was informed of by a primary source. Stalker Child at Enjoy Prison, which is one of the best names on Twitter, says Ethan Ralph has left Mexico and will be in Memphis for this for this Thursday through Sunday. He has challenged people to try and find him. Gun Hunt 2024 has kicked off. Uh, so this could be another epic, uh, uh, epic Ralph misdirection. We will see. Is he so clever? Is he so smart and funny that he has misdirected? Everybody yet again with his extremely high IQ. Only time will tell. Yes, Gabe Hoffman really, really hates Ralph. I went over that. Um, okay, so I will watch. I have not watched. Okay, this is one of those things where I, I hear, I know what it's about. I've seen it. I thought about it, but I have set it aside for a genuine reaction. Now, in the legal sphere, Actually, this might require a little bit of an Alyssa clip to uh, proper show people. Let me just hop back over to I'm gonna do Alyssa clips. And I'll just play like a second of this because it's not so important. You'll, you'll understand very quickly um, what the gist is. And I can find it. Okay, so... Um, there is a woman that's suing Disney. And, uh, of course, because this is a big lawsuit, it's, like, perfectly in that parallel economy. It's, like, right up Rumble's alley. Like, all the people on Rumble that do shows about politics and shit, obviously they're going to talk about this kind of thing. So everybody chipped in. And Legal Mindset uh, thought, thought you know, it would be funny if I just watch all these – all these other law tubers give their takes about the, the lawsuit and then rank on a tier list – uh, how informed they were, how uh, strong their legal arguments were, how thoughtful, you know, so on and so forth. So he decided to just grade them. Uh, and he gave poor Riketa um, an F. Uh, we've got one more. Got one more. And, so of course, him. that is the Rickety Rackets. And then he so let them. us. So this this is where I'm going to put this at. Wow. Okay. Um, I, I honestly, I honestly, like, I don't even know what to say. I don't want to. He didn't read the complaint. So my threshold for C tier was reading the complaint. I I mean, D oh, look, tier is. I see potentially criminal up there. You got an S. Legal mindset has given my boy an S for super good. Clear. He'll make a D tier. It might even be F. But I want to I want to put it here because it's locals. It's late night. He didn't know. He gave a good defamation analysis, but that was completely wrong. But yeah, so his, he, he got like wait, no, he does drop a little a bit, later. like a shade of the basic facts, oh, right? Potential criminal, Nate. Here, here, the f bomb. Percent sixty. Okay, we'll see. I'll give it a second here. Oh, he did All a right, poll. I'm checking the poll. He I'm checking the poll. That's why. Sixty-three percent of he you wanted to go easy on Ricada because it was um. It was just a shitty local stream, and he admitted up front that he didn't do any research into what he was saying and just did, like, an off-the-cuff analysis of theoretically what he thought the case might be. And so legal said, well, he admits that it was a shit legal take because he, you know, was drunk eating garbage in his kitchen as he fucking does. This is half of his content at this point. So I'll be nice. I'll give him a D. But then legal said, okay, I'll do a poll. What do you guys think? And everyone said F because they like to shit on Riketa. <laughs> that's really that's really in vogue right now. So I gave him an F. Uh, Riketa did, did like a wobbly, oh, I don't care what people think about me. That's how I am as a streamer. You know, everything I do, I, I do for myself, for my fans. And if people don't like it, well, they can pound dirt or whatever. However, upon orders, believed to be upon orders of Commander uh, Dick Masterson uh, of uh, Arish Kamizarat uh, has ordered Ethan Ralph, a lowly peon, to cut a promo making fun of legal mindset for daring to say that uh, Ricardo Law is an F of anything. Uh, let's listen until I get bored of it. I like Ricardo. Fuck legal mindset. He can fucking choke to death on a dick and join too mad for all I care. Imagine being, 
Like that's a that's like a hard thing to cut a promo on. Okay, so a law tuber did legal analysis of different law tuber takes and found that Nick Ricada's take was one of the worst. Ha, ha, you're really upset about this. Everything that Ricada says is true and factual and the best possible take. You're gonna do eight minutes making fun of this guy you've never heard of before now. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, here's my legal mindset. Here's my legal mindset. Come put me in jail, cocksucker. Oh, that works. Because I ain't going back to jail. I'd rather be six feet under than back in that fucking hell hole. Come put me in jail. Nobody has said that he's going to jail. Why? Why? I guess it's because when you cut a, a profile... Or cut a uh, uh, what was it called? Cut a uh, promo. Then you just have to like go off the cuff and say shit, right? So he's like, okay, well, what do I have to rant about? He's a lawyer. I guess lawyers are kind of involved in the criminal justice process. I don't want to go back to jail. It's one of my favorite things to say. Uh, yeah, I'll just say that he's trying to put me back in jail for some reason. That's my fucking legal mindset. God fucking damn it! Please, chat. Do not let Ethan Ralph take the lord's name in vain and say the lord's name with the f word okay put me in the ground legal mindset legal mindset legal dick sucker is more like it fuck you bitch faggot looking motherfucker looking it looks really normal he looks kind of like um that supreme court justice kavanaugh you know what i mean just a little bit like him i didn't like you from the moment i fucking first heard your voice which was three days ago ricada made you i'd love to see him suck the shit out of you too which i have no doubt that he probably would <laughs> Hold up. Rikita would slap the shit out of this guy. Hold up. Let's get a recent video of Rikita. By the way, you can see that he's changed like the color temperature on his videos so that he doesn't look so like disgusting. You know what? Like I'll show you because you can tell. Okay. You can oh, these are perfect side by sides. There was a there was this is a recent Ricada video and this is like I from a few days ago. Do you see the color temperature is like just completely changed? Because he just looks like a age ridden ridden zombie. He's like it's like he's an animated corpse back from the dead to on on a task by his necromancer to find all the fifths of whiskey and drink them all. And then he's like, oh, fuck, I look terrible. How am I going to hit on uh, my Discord kittens when I look like such shit? I know. I'll just add a piss tinge hue to my camera, and then I'll look like a human being with color in his flesh again. <laughs> so here we go. This guy versus this guy. I don't know. If I had to pick, they look like they're about the same age. Um, I This guy has at least like 40 pounds on him, especially now that he's like proto-AIDS victim. I would bet on, the, I would bet on my boy, Kavanaugh. I know for fucking shit I would. The jaundice filter. <laughs> if I add the jaundice filter, they'll never know that I'm in uh, liver failure. Come on, Ralph. Come Legal on. Mindset. Some fucking piece of shit. This is low energy, Ralph. Like, you, you can't just, like, if you just take the music out of this, it's like, oh, this guy, fuck him. He's a piece of shit. I want this guy. Oh. Fuck you, bitch. I ain't going to jail. Oh, 
Okay, I give up. You lost me, Ralph. Boring. I rate. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. One second. I have to find something. I think this is it. Okay. I just want to. Surely there's like a button I can press for this, right? Okay, perfect. I must be logged in. Oh no. No, no, no. You're not forcing me to log in. I am going to go to paint. I'm going to crop this out. I'm going to save as thing. I'm then going to go to my folder. I am going to go and I am going to put this on my screen. Will chat be able to figure out what I'm doing as I do this live? Then I will do take snapshot, save to downloads. And then I'm going to put this on the screen. Oh, what is Josh doing? Ralph, I'm rating your promo an F. It's not even on the screen. Theoretically speaking, if there was an F tier on this chart for this promo, comparing it to no other promos that I know about, it's going in the F tier. Because you're sitting there with fucking music playing, saying absolutely nothing for eight goddamn minutes. No excitement, no passion. You don't even know who he is. You've never seen this guy before. You have no idea what he looks like, and you're defending somebody who has AIDS. That is all the makings of an F tier chat. Give him the big thumbs down, the thumbs down arena for being a loser. Okay. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!